Hi guys! Please subscribe to this channel and like the video to support my project and we are starting a new adventure. Today I will show you a museum that is unique in the world. This museum is dedicated to the Father Festival of Valencia. The collection of the museum consists of, uh, pardon it, minutes uh, created uh, to be grass of uh, the flames. They are chosen by popular vote and uh, saved uh, from the flame to be visited here in this museum. Yes, according to the traditions of the festival, minutes are burned at the end of the celebration. The museum also displays posters dedicated to the festival and information on the history of uh, the creation of the figures, the Ninots. While we are walking around uh, the museum, I will tell you a little about the history of this festival. There are so many figures uh, here that uh, you can easily get confused uh, in the chronology. And uh, I still got confused. But uh, this is not so important. Uh, most of the uh, dates of creation I will show you at any case. So, Fadis is traditional celebration held annually in commemoration of uh, San Josef in the city of Valencia. The festival is celebrated uh, from 15 to 19 March. In 2016, the Fadis festival was added uh, to the UNESCO list of intangible cultural heritage of humanity. In every area of Valencia, there is an organized group of people called the Casal Fale. This group operates whole year, hosting fundraising parties and dinners, usually with paella, a specialty of uh, the region. Each uh, Casal Fale creates a structure known as uh, Fala, which is burned at the end of the festival, with the exception of those uh, selected for this museum at the end of the festival. The name of the festival is a plural of the Valencian word Fala. The meaning of this word is translated as a torch. For four days, each group brings their figure to the Grand Parade. All ninots are built in accordance with the Greek term with a satirical bias. Brigades of artists and craftsmen, sculptors and painters are working on preparation for the festival all year round. They spent months creating complex structures up to five-story high, made up of uh, bizarre figures. All Casa Faler compete with each other. During the Fales, uh, many people wear costumes from different historical eras of uh, Valencia. Five days and uh, nights of uh, the festival is a non-stop street party. Many thematic processions are organized, historical, religions and uh, comedic. Expositions of uh, firecrackers are heard uh, day and night. Each day of the festival starts at 8 am with a signal called La Desperta, alarm signal. Then brass bands appear and start marching through the streets playing live music. Large firecrackers fall directly behind them. Explosions of firecrackers and fireworks take place every day of the festival at 2 p.m. There is also a competition for the opportunity to hold the final fireworks display on the last day of the festival. There are also fireworks at night. These fireworks during the festival called La Mascleta. Until the 15th March, uh, the first day of the festival, the construction of all figures must be completed. On March 1718, flowers are brought to the statue of the Virgin Mary. On the last evening of the Fales at 7 pm, there is a parade called uh, the Cavalcade del Foc, the Fire Parade. This performance is the grand final of uh, the Fales and a great noisy event, including exhibitions of various rites and performances that use fire. On the last night of the festival, the ninots are burned like a huge bonfires. This is known as La Crema, the burning, and this is the culmination of the whole event, and this is why the figures are called Fales. But let's try to understand the origin of this festival. There are various assumptions about this. 
One suggests that the fathers began in the Middle Ages when artisans disposed of broken artifacts and pieces of wood they had saved over the winter by burning them to celebrate the vernal equinox. Valencia carpenters uh, used uh, planks of wood called uh, paratas to hang uh, candles in winter as uh, they were needed to, to light the work. With the onset of spring, uh, they were no longer needed, uh, so they were burned. Over time, and uh, with the intervention of uh, the church, the date of uh, the burning of these uh, parrots uh, was uh, timed to coincide uh, with the celebration of uh, the Feast of San Josef, the patron saint of uh, carpenters. This tradition continued to develop, and people began to dress uh, paratas uh, to that uh, they could uh, resemble a man. Later, that uh, paratas can be identified with certain famous people. To collect materials uh, to these, children went uh, from house to house asking from Una Estareta Veleta, an old truck, to add uh, to paratas. Uh, later, it became a popular song that uh, children sang uh, as uh, they collected all uh, sorts of uh, old uh, furniture and uh, utensils uh, to burn in a fire along with uh, these figures. These uh, paratas were the first ninots. So over the year, this uh, tradition has uh, grown into a grand celebration. Until the early 20th century, the fathers looked like big boxes containing three or four wax dolls dressed in uh, close clothing. This changed when uh, the creators began to use uh, cardboard. The production of uh, the fathers continued to develop in our time. Today, the polystyrene is used for manufacturing. There was such an ancient pagan custom uh, to light a fire to welcome spring. In Valencia, this ancient tradition led to, to the burning of accumulated waste, especially wood, at the end of winter, on the day of uh, the Fest of San Josef. Later, a humorous character was added to, to this tradition and people began to burn figures depicting people and events of uh, the past year. Burning symbolized celebration uh, from a life of uh, slavery before the memory of these events, or presented a humorous and often critical commentary of them. This, uh, the festival acquired a more satirical and ironic character. In early 20th century, and especially during the Spanish Civil War, figures were often highly critical of uh, local uh, national governments, who have tried many times without success to ban uh, Fales. Under the dictatorship of uh, Francisco Franco, the celebration lost much of its uh, satirical nature due to state uh, censorship, but uh, the figures uh, were among uh, the few public performances than permitted. During this period, uh, many religious uh, customs were adopted, such as uh, the offering of uh, flowers uh, to the Virgin Mary, which uh, today is also an integral part of uh, the festival. With the restoration of democracy and the end of uh, the state censorship, the critical and satirical uh, feathers uh, reparate. This is the history of the festival. I hope that soon I will be able to back to Valencia and film the festival itself. In the meantime, let's continue walking around the museum and see the figures displayed here.
That's all for today. I thank you for your attention. Please subscribe to my channel and like the video. And see you in new interesting places.